right y'all welcome back to another episode here on restoration my name is david i go by rev here and on this episode we're gonna have a multiplicity now we're gonna do a lot of different things uh today on restoration i'm gonna try to crank up a few vehicles old pudding's gonna be on that list uh yeah maybe we will go back to an oldie but goodie and see if she'll start for the first time in a long time uh cold start challenge that is kind of a uh, comical when it comes to georgia if i tell you what the temperature is you would say that's a springtime crank that's not a uh, uh a cold start challenge but hey it's windy and about as cold as it gets in georgia so we're going to uh, uh we're going to crank the truck and we're going to crank an old car and see how that goes and then y'all the wind's blowing a little bit but i want to tell you the old truck's got a good belly remember we put in a new gas tank and boy this old engine the heart is just a pumping in this old thing i believe i could drive it anywhere i wanted to but old pudding ain't got no soul so because pudding ain't got no soul we're gonna rectify that in today's episode we'll see you after an intro So let me let you in on a secret of YouTube. When you hit that subscribe button, it is absolutely free to you, but it immensely blesses me. Hey, Puddin', don't let me down. Don't let me down, Puddin'. All right, y'all, here's old Puddin'. It's at least a two or three pump method. Uh, I didn't crank it, that was just a fan. All right, baby. Uh, 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 come on. Gotta keep her going a little bit. I played around with a carburetor yesterday. What y'all think? I think the carburetor's still. Might have adjusted the carburetor out a little bit too much. There she is, folks. Old Puddin's still a runner. putting back in reverse in one of the spots because I'm gonna be working on her today oh yeah That's... let me let you get back in here a little bit of sound Right, y'all if there's a chance if there is a chance to start this old mercury this old mercury it's gonna take uh it's gonna take a battery out of pudding so pudding needs a battery um i'm gonna bring this camera back here probably gonna have to put some gas uh into the carburetor and it'll be the first time it's cranked in a uh well since the last video on this one which was a good little while ago so if i can get the hood up get a battery in it get some fuel into the carburetor i think that 390 will bark off let's see Yeah. 
much, y'all. I'm just gonna put a battery in it and I'm gonna drop this down into a fuel tank that I've got over here. Let's just see if she'll bark. Every first start should always have a Mountain Dew bottle in it. If you're not drinking it, maybe you can see if the Mountain Dew will actually start the engine. So I'm gonna mix a little gasoline in with it. Time. And remember the only door that works is this one so i've got to go around open the driver's door don't let it shut all right oh this baby's dirty Okay, let's put the key in. That's in park. Up foot feed. All right, I've got no battery. Neutral relay, maybe. I'm gonna set you down. All right, y'all, let's see. All right. There we go. <laughs> she fired. She fired. <laughs> Look at there, y'all. That dog going 390. All it needed was a little bit of gas. Them mufflers are rough. But she's running. <laughs> she's running horribly, but she's running. Oh, she just cut off. Cold start for sure. All right, let's give it a little bit more gas. All right, set you down again. I've got it revved up a little bit. All right, y'all, that exhaust is horrible. <laughs> there she is. engine hasn't been run hasn't been run in a long time since the last video she runs cold start didn't even have to add any gas had gas in the carburetor had to turn it over a few times the spring on the uh, foot feed isn't right so i have to pull the pedal back up i need to replace the spring on it This moisture blowing out the tailpipe. I think just dissipating, so I don't think it's white smoke. just water this moisture <laughs> she's running y'all all right y'all there's a youtuber that is supposed to be buying this car from me uh 
it's got a lot of work that needs to be done to it uh, I of course pulled it out of the weeds got it running uh, so this rig's for sale but she starts all right y'all if you look at Putin's interior oh it needs a lot of work yep even looking up I'm going to the plan for the interior I'm going to replace the headliner I'm going to either cover this with leather or cover it back with vinyl uh, I can clean all of the dash up of course I've got a few vent holes I need floor pans on both sides um, but the truck runs really well I have been driving it uh, this actually did a doozy on me uh, I had to take all of this off this locking system here uh, I was going down the road just driving down the road and all of a sudden all my brakes said and locked down on me and uh, because of that uh, I had to get over try to figure out I actually drove it back uh, with all the brakes basically being held down uh, but what it was is it was letting it in but wouldn't have let it out so I had to bypass all of that to get it going uh, but Puddin's got a fuel tank and it works Puddin's got a motor and it works Puddin don't have no heart no so it has heart but Puddin has no soul all right i don't know if y'all are anything like me but when you're riding down the road and you don't have the radio on i mean there's something wrong and uh old Puddin has run me down the road a bunch and i've got a lot i want to do to Puddin. i want to work on the interior but i got the motor running got the brake stopping got the fuel pumping i mean we got all that going right that is good i'm able to drive it virtually anywhere i want to but what I can't do is listen to music. The old radio in it ain't working. I don't like cutting up the dash. I don't like doing all that. So what I'm going to do is it's got a heart, but it ain't, I mean, it ain't got a soul. It ain't got the, you know, it needs some good old Alan Jackson or maybe some uh, Third Day, maybe some Barbara Mandrell. I don't know what type of music y'all listen to. Uh, but hey, if you can't play Dolly on the radio, or if you can't play when me and Nikki T are riding, I need some old Mr. Blue Eyes. I mean, I need some, some Sinatra going on. I don't know what all I need, but I do know that I need music in Puddin', and Puddin' needs some music. So we're gonna work that today. I'm gonna build a box, and as I build a box, I'm gonna do a lot of different things today. We're gonna work with wood. We're gonna work with fabric. We're gonna work with electronics, but I'm gonna do all that. So before, hopefully before this episode is over with, Puddin's gonna have some tunes. So let me show you what all I had to buy at Wally World, at Target, and yes, I even went to a fabric store. All right, here we go. All right, here's a, uh, here's just a Sony. Bought this at Walmart. This uh, Sony, it does have Bluetooth. Uh, so of course, that'll be the radio that I'm using. I got a, a dash kit. Uh, all I really want is the outside piece of this so that I can pop this in. This will go in the box. I wanted to get some Sony speakers, but they didn't have the outside grates. So I got these. How do you say that word? Not Porsche, but Scorse, I guess. I uh, got those speakers. I probably will just use, uh, probably I will just use the four inch speakers. Maybe the five and a half. I don't know. I don't know which one of these that I'll use. Uh, got speaker wire. Uh, of course, I've got a uh, stapler. Uh, I've got an issue with my air compressor, so I've got to fix my air compressor. I have one of these somewhere, but I just went on and got this uh, staple so that I can use this. I also have uh, multi-purpose adhesive. Uh, this is going to help get the vinyl stick where I want it to. Of course, I'm going to cut a few holes and drop these down for uh, the holder. Also, I've got a few other things that I'm going to try. Uh, I don't know if it's going to work, but um, all we can do now... All we can do now is let's get to it. So I'm getting to work. Friends, sometimes people wonder, is there, you know, is there a limit to what you will try? And my answer is always, you know, I may try anything within the bonds of what the Lord tells me I can and can't do. I'll try anything once. I tried rutabagas one time. I won't be doing that again. Uh, we lived in Alaska for a little while. And there were some things I tried in Alaska. Nope, I won't be trying again. But let me let you in on something. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things that scare us because we've never done it before. And sometimes if we do it for ourselves, we may learn we can. It's pretty easy. 
uh, you know, everybody had to try something that they're professional at first one time. So you really don't know if you can do it until you try it. So today I'm gonna to build this box. I'm gonna install this radio. I've done this before. I'm gonna sew some vinyl. I've never sewed vinyl. Uh, I'm going to wrap this in vinyl. I'm gonna make it work. Why? Because I'm willing to try it. I'm willing to do it, whatever it takes. So uh, just a little encouragement from Rev to you. Hey, give it a shot. You never know, it might work. Probably should not be showing this because if it doesn't turn anything, if it doesn't turn out like this, then it's gonna make me look a little crazy. Um, but this is what my intention is. Uh, of course, I wanna build the box. Of course, the front of the box will be here. Uh, this section here that I'm showing with my pen will probably be cut out because there is a, uh, this is gonna go over the hump in the truck in the center. And of course the cutout on the bottom is gonna go like this and be a little bit longer on the sides so that it can hold in. I may pop a few screws in here through the side of the tunnel to hold it. Of course the radio, uh, the radio will be right there. Uh, this is gonna be the radio face. It's gonna have a little bit of an angle here. Uh, this angle is gonna give the radio face kind of an up looking uh, direction so we can see what tunes is being played got two cup holders that i want to go here and then i got a tray that i may try to uh set in on the top just to hold stuff uh but i'm not 100 positive i did forget that i think the radio actually has a double hanging thing there so we're going to figure that out so this is going to be a work in progress we're going to make it work um it's not going to be perfect so the wood is going to be covered in vinyl and and probably a little rubber type uh, mat. Uh, so all that is going to be done, and uh, when we get that done, should be should be ready to go. All right. One of the first things I'm going to do is I want it uh, 11 inches. Um, want it 11 inches wide or 12 inches long? I don't know wide. And I want to make sure the kerf is right on both sides. Let's see, 11, 11, what I'll do is go get some glasses, oh come on, alright, going to get safety glasses. Alright, that's a good thing about being an eBay reseller, is I had these for sale, they're not for sale anymore. Alright, so, let's cut this board. Sometimes you can't get a visual until you do duct tape. So I'm gonna put this baby together with some duct tape and then I'll be able to draw out the sides. Then I'll be able to get to cutting. So there's one angle. All right, here's gonna be the next. So that tape will go on this side. <laughs> this is all in my head, y'all. And I'm sure 
if you're watching this, you're thinking, what is this cat doing? Isn't there an easier way? Probably is. But that easy way, still not the way I do it. I did that wrong. I'm going to drill them together. Tape's not working. Right, YouTube world this is what the outside of the box is going to look like so now I've got to cut the two pieces of board that'll fit on each side of this this will have our speaker and our speaker and uh, that'll be it I hope all right y'all I'm still eyeballing the box uh, so I'm gonna show you now uh, what I'm doing I've got the sides uh, I've got the sides cut here, so I'm going to draw this line and cut this out on both sides, and then the sides will be ready. I'll take these screws out and put it in. All right, YouTube, here's the mock-up of the box. Of course, I'm going to should get out of the shadow. Uh, here's the mock-up. Of course, speakers will be here. Probably should have had this angled, but uh, I'm good with old box. The, uh, the radio will go here. The cup holders will go here. Let's sit it in the truck and see what it looks like. The uh, back cut, it sits better. It sits flat. Um, so I've got to get the holes. Got to get my holes cut here for the cup holder. Got to get my hole cut here uh, for the radio. So now I'm going to take it all apart and uh, start that. That ain't good. All right, y'all, I don't like it when a plan don't work out, but I promise you the sewing machine was not gonna sew this vinyl. I guess it needs to be more uh, industrial grade sewing machine that just sews fabric and this vinyl is too thick. So we're gonna have to do it uh, a different way. If you don't have, if the tool you have don't work, use the tool that you have, make it whatever. You know what I'm trying to say. We're gonna make this rascal work, there ain't no doubt. You know what type cars cats drive? Them old Cadillacs. Why did the spider buy a sports car? He did it so he could take it for a spin. Did y'all hear that Jimi Hendrix was in a car accident when he was 16? Luckily, it was just a fender bender. Why is Miss Piggy such a bad driver? But all she does is hog the road. You know what type of car my dog hates? A Corvette. You know what's got four tires and flies? A garbage truck. <laughs> you know where my dog wants to park his car? In the barking lot. <laughs> hey y'all, an ice cream truck about hit me yesterday. I was utterly terrified. All right, I ain't doing no more. That's okay, I'm done. Bye, y'all. All 
right y'all um i do want to thank y'all so very much for watching we're going to close out this episode but i want to say before we go um you probably saw me break in during the the video because hey i was really working i mean i wasn't in character i wasn't telling jokes i wasn't making fun of anything it was just me and the camera it's the first time i've done one of these videos in a long time so i'm gonna pop in and share some awesome cool amazing dad jokes so throughout the video hopefully you have enjoyed those i want to share with you before we go um something and then i want to share with you reality so the something was this maybe you remember earlier i showed you this and we pointed out that this was going to be the box i didn't draw the speaker here uh, all of that was going to be the box cup holders the radio and look at here dun, dun, dun. yep there it is i mean that's it i mean that's the uh, cleanest thing in the truck and uh, i don't want to get in trouble uh turn the ignition on the ignition is on radio is on so uh uh there it is it's working so folks um i thank you so very much for watching this episode i appreciate you uh we cold cranked the uh, old pudding we cold cranked the mercury and uh hopefully that fit the challenge and hey uh pudding's already got a, a heart that's working well it's got a stomach that's pumping gas and now old pudding's got a soul and we can let some of these music just blare we love y'all we appreciate you watching and as always we know no way of closing out any of these videos and saying deuces may god bless <laughs>